ready? Let's get this one started here. Round one is underway. And we've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is. And this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Throws the right hand there. Oh, caught him with a head kick. That at least partially landed. Oh, my goodness. He got kicked in the head, and he's still standing. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Lee gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Maybe a cut to the left of the nose. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh, you can feel the breeze there. Swinging a miss by Lee. There, huge block for him. Oh, it's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. And he landed the right hand there. Good is that right hand. Thirty seconds now to go in round one. Lee's strike attempt there is blocked. That was a thudding leg kick. Final seconds here. Round two next. All right, that one signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, so the next round is underway. Will it be more of the same? And by that, I mean all of those strikes to the body. You gotta think at some point the opposition is gonna lower that or get finished. And that's exactly what he is hoping for. All those great body shots, all that damage he's putting on his opponent will force an opening up top where he will look to finish. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Straight punch lands. Oh, blocks that kick to the bottom. Nicely done. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Just over three minutes now to go in round two. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. 
Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Nice punch lands over the top. Real sneaky body kick. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Pretty good right hand. Big body kick. Just out of range with that right hook. Make him work. Move. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Changes his stance. Well placed kick there by Lee. Tags him with a flush left. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Ten seconds remain in round two. Ten minutes in the books. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC, and if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, the action continues here and now as our next round gets underway. The previous round won't be confused for a round of three. It was a pretty good action. It was a pretty good round. Not every round is going to have you standing up out of your seat. You understand that you are watching the highest level of fighting in the entire world in the UFC. To the body, to the body. Nice punch by Lee. Just misses there with the left. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Big kick land. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, look at the redness underneath that left elbow. He is badgering that left side of the body. What a body kick. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. Beautiful strike. Liver kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Oh, caught him flush with the head kick. What a kick by this young man. He does a great job of disguising that technique. And before you know it, boom, he lands. Huge block there. Where are your hands? Just missed with the left there. Nice straight punch. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Whoa! He was hurt. Serve him up. Oh. Go get him. Back to the feet. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Straight right hand, no good. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. All 
right, so there's the end of the round. Few things in MMA more devastating than a head kick and nearly produced a knockout for him there. We talked to him earlier in the week, and he talked about chances to take the kicks high. He got a chance, he took it, he landed that kick and almost got the fight finished. Let's see if he can go and do that again. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Beautiful kick. Lee's got a bruise now starting to appear on the right side of his body. Oh, vicious kick to the outside of that lead leg. You gotta start checking these, He's man. You gotta check these kicks, or you're gonna be limping around the octagon very short. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. Check it, check it, check it. He blocks the punch. Keep your hands up. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Just over three minutes to go. Good punch. What a tricky head kick. Oh, beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab. A swing and a miss by Lee. How about that shin? Oh, big punch lands. Straight to the body by Lee. Look at the turnover in that kick. They continue to exchange. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch, I just put a smile on my face. Well, he's got a pretty good sidekick, and you saw it right there. He did it great, and it pushed his opponent back. Notice how it creates space and allows him to get back to where he's coming. 15 seconds. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, man, head to play. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last one. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. All right, next round is underway. He really did a nice job defensively in the previous round. You're not always winning with defense in MMA, but the crowd was ooing and eyeing as he moved that head off the side. I mean, line. it was defensive brilliant. Yeah. I mean, just the ability to move, to roll his shoulders, to get his hands up and block his head as his opponent was trying to attack him, was a sight to behold. It was a thing of beauty to watch a guy with such a vast understanding of defensive fighting. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Big kick lands. Able to check that kick as well. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. It's good punch, Lance. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Whiffs on the straight right hands. Man, look at his torso. That just can't feel good. Look at the size of that bruise on his body. And you got to think his opponent is going to continue to attack that area. 
Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. He talked a lot to us about his length and his size advantage. Doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it certainly did. All right, late in the fight now, he needs a finish or he's gonna lose this fight tonight. We'll see if he goes for it. I mean, he's gotta pull out all the stops. There is no more strategy. There is no more time to try to set up a punch. You gotta just start letting everything fly. Oh, that's a nice strike. Kick to the body now, that one won't land. Under two minutes remain in the fight. Unable to connect there. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. One minute to go in the fight. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> Right under the elbow. Nice. Looking to set up a knee of his own. Oh, tags him with that money left again. Sniff that one out as he blocks the kick. Now connects with the right. He landed that inside leg kick. What a fight! All right, so the fighters go the distance here tonight, but it went a whole lot better for one of them than the other. Talk us through the replays, champ. Some decisions are different than others, and his striking really did separate him from the competition. He fought so well in the stand-up game that he should get a very easy decision. 